All right, what's up? Name is Justin. I'm gonna walk y'all through how to fix an Asus X401U screen. Uh, just a pre-warning. I have never fixed a screen in my life, so this is gonna be quite interesting. Um, but I've read a lot of forums and watched a lot of videos, so hopefully this goes right the first time. If not, then obviously you won't see this post. So bam, let me show you how bad my screen is. Uh, bam ugly I know I know now no way shape or form am I an expert on what's going on but we're gonna see if I can get this right the first time so the first thing we need to do I need I need to power this baby off I'm gonna do I'm gonna power off the wrong way don't worry about it take out the battery two little levers right here click it one clicks one stays the other one doesn't boom we don't want to get electrocuted step two get you a good angle here Open up the laptop, bam, and we got to remove some some screws. Now, since we should be working on the same laptop, your screws are here. You can't see it. Whatever. They're in the they're in the bottom corners. Now, you may not see a screw initially because Ace is, is pretty good at hiding them, and they put a a little like black screen over it, I guess. So I got like this tool right here. It's random. I'm using household tools here just to let you know. And you peel it off. Oh, it jumped somewhere. I don't know where. Whatever. It flew off. Take it off. Next, I need my screwdriver. Bam. I need to unscrew these jokers. Whenever you're um, whenever you get the screws out, make sure you try to keep them separated. In a format that you can remember where they go. Luckily, it's not that many screws. On this one, it only be two. They're really small. It's only be two. Once you take those two out, you need to pry open this this protective layer. Now, I don't recommend this as much, but I have a plastic knife. I put my fingernail in there. Can you see me? What I put your fingernail. And I just slide up and pry it open. As you can see, open pretty easy. Boom, boom, all the way down, all in the corner. Turn it back so you can see what I'm doing. All the way, boom, boom. Bam. You want to take it? You want to lift up? You have to wiggle the rule a little bit, move the screen back. Bam. Comes off. Really simple. Put that right there. Next, you have four screws that you need to, that you need to take out. Now, this may be confusing, but you're gonna need a different screwdriver. Did I lose mine? Here we go. Really small screwdriver compared to the last one. A little bit smaller. Uh, use them for the iPhone and stuff. But there are four set of screws. Let's see if we can help you see. One, two, and two at the bottom. Now you're gonna see actually two screws in each corner on the Asus uh, X401U. It's the smaller of the two or the inside screw, so we need to take those four out. And if you're wondering why you can't see me, because I'm running this off a of webcam. I'm not a pro. I don't have any fancy devices. Just a normal guy trying to have a good computer screen. And I'm running off my webcam on my other computer. Bam. All four out. As you can see, they're really small. If you need to compare it to the last one, I don't know why. It just seems like I want to. Bam. Cool. Keep them separated. The screwdriver next to them. All right, now you need to lean that screen forward just a tad bit. Now be careful because we want to lay it down because there's a piece of tape right here, right here in the middle. That's an important piece of the uh, equipment right there. You want to remove that tape, be gentle. Move that tape. 
and then we want to remove the it slides out I'm gonna try. once you got that look at here bam my broken screen next we need our new screen uh, brand new screen I think I still got the tape and stuff over here they wrap these very very well I thought I didn't know what I was getting in the mail they put in like three different bags okay obviously we want to work in reverse order actually let me keep this on for a second to show you my brand new screen probably got smudges on it now but just because I want to lay this down I'm gonna keep the little protective thing on there lay it down it's the same way it says do not touch I touched it anyway because I want to feel it cool plug this back in makes a little clicking sound Tape. Cool, got it. Tape it. Bam. Lean it up. Go back to our original spots. So, baby screws. All right. So now we got all four back on. So we need to put the case back on. This baby right here, slide it on down, snap it, just go around and snap this baby, you can physically hear it, place the last two, bam, bam, I'm gonna close it. I'm gonna make sure it's tight. Close it right here. Just to make sure. Because it's underneath here. I'm gonna lock it in place. I'm just sliding my hand along back, make sure it's locked in place. Check all my sides. And let's give this a go. Hope this works. I've never done this before. Press the button. Oh, somebody's laughing. They're like, where is his battery? Put the battery back. Give me some juice. Open this baby up. Click the on button. Nothing is blown up yet. And I know I didn't replace those, but look at, look at here. Look at there. Start, man, I haven't seen this in a long time, y'all. Beautiful new screen. As you can see, it works. No black spots. This is actually, God, I, I upgraded my screen so it looks a little better. Um, other than that, thank y'all for watching. Once again, I've never done this before in my life. Not at one time. And this is actually the first time I made this video. So today we worked on the Asus screen. We had a little baby screwdriver. A little bit bigger screwdriver. Like I said, get it from a computer store. Also use a plastic knife to unpry. And you may need something like this. Or something like this. It doesn't really matter. Marine Corps. Text in it. Once again, thank y'all for watching. Make sure you buy a new laptop screen. And this is awesome because my screen is working. Peace.